Yes, I have no self-control. We love shiny things. Just finished up the gym. I'm gonna head home and take a shower and then we can start our Saturday adventures. If you're new here, my name is Monica and on Saturdays I go shopping basically. Um, I'm a teacher during the year and then I also work at Walmart two days a week and then during the summer I pretty much work at Walmart like five days a week, pretty much here and there. Like this week I worked like 50 hours, so a little bit more than five days a week. Um, woo, over time. During my weight interval training I was doing, which is like a 45 minute exercise period, I didn't have my watch going, which is such a bummer. So I only had it going for when I was on the elliptical for my cool down, which was like 15 minutes. So sad, I'm not gonna close my rings today, I think, unless I go back. Some of the machines I wanted to use were busy because the morning is a busy time. So maybe we'll go back later tonight if we're bored. Apparently this wind is uh, quite strong today, isn't it, Cheyenne? Poor Mr. Tomato! So right now my boyfriend is working night shifts, so I had to cook my eggs in the dark. So that wasn't ideal, but yeah, two pieces of my favorite cinnamon toast and some eggs with sriracha. We're gonna eat that and then I'm gonna water the plants and then it'll be time to go to Dunkin' Donuts. So I got this at Walmart last night. It is the Lottie London Wing Edition. It's like an eyeliner that like stamps a wing on top of your face and, and in TJ Maxx they still want you to wear a mask. Um, Target if you're vaccinated they don't require it. So I'm just gonna use my Glotion and use this and that's it for our Saturday makeup routine. Such a little, little itty bitty tip. Like, yes, I have a lot of eyeliners, but in my defense, I don't have any that have a stamp on it. And like, okay, this one is a heart stamp, but that's not a wig stamp. But I have like blues and greens and browns, so they're not all just black. And I don't think I've bought an eyeliner myself since middle school. I get them all the time in my Ipsy bag. So I mean, I'm not personally buying them, I'm just being given them by Ipsy. So mascara wise, we're gonna do Crim Shop on the bottom. We're gonna do probably Sky High on the top. That's like my current favorite. And then um, a couple vlogs ago, I bought this Milk Makeup Primer, so we'll use that too. So in case you're wondering, it's been a while since I've had videos uploading every single week because I've been struggling with my Wi-Fi to just upload things. It's been a huge problem. Right now there's a video uploading that I've had edited for a couple days, but it just takes me hours and hours to edit it and then randomly my computer will just shut off because it's been trying to do it for so long and then, you know, all the progress is saved and you have to start over again. I've had a video uploading since I woke up this morning, before I went to the gym, before I made breakfast and had a shower and all of that. And um, when I last looked, it was on like 20%. And it's not even like the speed, it's like the processing or whatever that it uses up with the video. So yeah, you can watch Netflix and Hulu and all of that simultaneous all at the same time. The minute you shut all of your electronics off and you try to upload a video, it's like, oh no, oh no. You're sitting on stuck of towels right now. So we're gonna use the Maybelline Lifter Gloss, just a little lip gloss before we go. A sad and pathetic 27%. I always consider it a successful day when I remember to bring my reusable bags. And not only just the reusable bags, but the freezer bag too. The high today is 85, which is absolutely wonderful because this past week the high has been like 95. And except for the day that I was at the lake with a friend, the rest of those days is just so miserably hot that I almost didn't want to go to McDonald's one day because I was just so hot. When you sit in your car and you take, I don't know, 10 minutes to go to lunch and back and your car is still like stifling hot when you go back from lunch, that is too hot. Y'all that live in the South, I couldn't do it. Give me the negative 50 degree weather any day. Hi, I'll get a large ice of the Butter Pecan Sunday Signature Ice Latte, but just no sprinkles. And then one thing of hash browns. I've discovered I prefer it without the sprinkles because the sprinkles get soggy and they get stuck in my straw and it's just a strange experience. They're the crispy kind too. My absolute favorite. Love a good crispy hash brown. There's so many cute Betsy Johnson sunglasses. 
trying to decide which ones I want. Obviously, I have a lot of hard glasses, but I don't have any that have an extra edge, and I don't have any like this either, but they're only $10, so maybe I'll end up getting both. We'll see what else we stumble upon here. <laughs> I really like this Lesser Evil popcorn. It's like a more healthy alternative to chips kind of. They have like cheese puff versions and other like actual chips, but I only ever seem to find the popcorn at TJ Maxx. Apparently it's at CVS, but every time I've gone to CVS for the sole reason of getting just Lesser Evil food, they don't have it. I ended up getting both pairs of sunglasses. Yes, I have no self-control. So this pair, and then this pair. I don't think I even own white sunglasses. Everything I own is some variation of like rainbow holographic. So it'll be good for me trying to, you know, act more like an adult. And then I grabbed this highlighter stick that I showed you guys in the store. I'll just pop that out. And she was like, for $3, come on. Everybody needs a highlighter stick. The sunglasses were 10 each, and then those popcorn was $2.50. cool. We love shiny things. Then I grabbed this two pack. They're um, sports bras, the 90 degree brand. I have a couple leggings that I really like from there too. Um, I didn't really need this yellow tie dye. It's good, but like the white is what I was actually wanting. I don't really have that many white bralettes and it was $14.99 for both of them, which is a really good price. This nail polish was at the checkout and I was thinking about painting my nails tonight. I was like, wow, that looks like such a pretty blue. It's like a blue shiny metallic for $3.99. So I grabbed that. And then I also found this when I was just browsing around. Teach, love, inspire a teacher shirt at TJ Maxx for $10. Yes, get in my cart. And that my friends is this week's TJ Maxx haul. So exciting. So let's go into Target what we can find this week really I think I just need monster and soda for my boyfriend check out the dollar spot check out the clothes and then end up like you know with like $50 worth of stuff that I don't actually need that's what my Walmart money is for two jobs so I can buy what I want reusable bags finish the drinks let's go it is June 12th and the teacher stuff is already out like some people are still in school a little early Target. So this kind of looks like, you know, cheap stuff. Rulers, kaleidoscopes, stencils, little eyeball things you could use for reading. Play that is really small. You could get more play for that for a dollar. They've got the clear little treasure chest. They've got dice, timers, dice, timers. clearance of all of their summer things because apparently summer's already over. I'm assuming after this week all the Father's Day stuff will be gone and then they'll have more teacher stuff here too. Here's the shirt I'm wearing. Ten dollar. gonna be a boring target day and I got some granola some yogurt and a whole bunch of soda because it was on sale my boyfriend really likes Mountain Dew but I went to Starbucks to treat myself and I was like really feeling like a fruity drink but also a coffee drink too so I wanted a grande star drink and a venti ice white chocolate mocha and they messed up they did it a venti instead and so they just gave it to me originally I wanted a pink drink but they're out of the strawberry base or whatever they use um, which isn't surprising because there's like a Starbucks shortage like nationwide, which is interesting because we're kind of like at the end of the pandemic. So you wouldn't expect there to be so many supply issues with something as basic as like caramel drizzle or like coconut milk, but apparently it's still a thing. So let's go home and make some lunch. It is a Hello Fresh meal. Of course, we get it three times a week. Not sponsored, we just really like having our food basically dropped on our doorstep for us. It's three o'clock in the afternoon and look how far this YouTube video has gotten. Wow, 51%. I think I started uploading it around 9 a.m. So at this rate, 
Maybe it'll be done by 10 o'clock. So normally on Saturdays, I have a really bad habit of crawling in bed and taking a nap for like two hours and just <laughs> wasting my Saturday. I'm a really good sleeper. I normally go to bed between 10 and midnight and I wake up at like eight, nine. I don't need a nap. So today we have our two drinks and we have an apartment that is a mess and mostly it's a mess because my boyfriend's been working really long shifts. Like right now he's at work. He's working 3 p.m. to 6 a.m. That's miserable. And I mean, I've been working like longer shifts too, but not as long as he is. For sure, we need to deal with that. So let's do dishes. So here's a before. Ooh, real life, dirty kitchen. Woo. Let's clean it. Okay, dishwasher is going. Counter is clean. This section is not yet um has anyone else discovered like cleaning tiktok uh apparently this is like the best cleaning thing you could ever discover in your entire life so i'm gonna try it i got it from target so basically i just need to get a little scrub mommy wet rub it in the paste and the gunk goes away beautiful utensil cup from target lovely paper towel holder walmart target Walmart. Now let's clean this nasty thing. Y'all, it is five o'clock and my video is at 73%. You know, like three hours left to upload. How am I supposed to have a great summer filled with great content and great uploads when it takes nine hours to upload the video it's only 10 minutes long so cleaning you know it's pretty good i got distracted by cleaning up my cat's um water dish and then i sat down finished my starbucks came back over here started cleaning the floor got annoyed that my swiffer wasn't working very well to get some of these spots and i was like you know what i hate cleaning the floor why don't I buy a floor scrubber? So, spent an hour researching the best floor scrubbers, found like literally the best one, and it says it's on rollback at Walmart for $150, when normally it's like $250, and it's in stock at my local Walmart, says the app. I guess we'll see. And we only have one garbage bag left, so uh, we're going to Walmart. Hi, Shiggy. Hello. So, laundry is going. Not shocking to anyone. The dryer is still broken, so... First, I'm gonna hang up my wet laundry on our little drying rack because it's like Laura Ingalls Wilder in this place for like, I don't know, six months now. I don't know what is wrong with my apartment complex, but yes, it's still broken. So then after that, I'll see you guys at Walmart. Here's hoping that they have it. Well, I'm not shocked because this happens at Walmart all the time. The system says we have seven of them. Nobody knows where they are. So I put in an order for pickup today, AKA tomorrow. We'll see if they can find it. Basically, if you order pickup today and they can't find it on the sales floor, they go digging around in the back room, looking up paths and stuff to see where they are. So hopefully someone finds it. Otherwise I'll have to wait because then they'll just ship it from the website to me. I wanted it now though, man. I was in a cleaning mood, but now, We've cleaned, we've done so many dishes. Do we want to dirty more dishes making dinner? Oh no, oh no, we want Culver's. Hi, I'll get just one um, butter burger, cheese, just the burger, and then- Is it a single or a double? Just a single. Actually, you know what, you can make it a meal and I'll have pretzel bites with it. Perfect. And then I'll have uh, root beer to drink. Thank you. Thanks. Pretzel bites, man, they get you every time. 95%. It is now almost nine o'clock. It has literally been sitting there for like 30 minutes. Why do bad things happen to good people? Literally it's been 11 hours to upload a 10 minute video. This day has not turned out how I thought it would, let me just say that. But I forgot to show you what I got at Walmart and let me tell you, it is so exciting. A beautiful stair -like tub to organize some of my boyfriend's junk in the closet and some garbage bags. And some dry erase markers. Exactly the haul y'all were waiting for, I'm sure. So, no joke, just hit my ear getting into the car and uh, lost the back to an earring, which is a bummer because these are really nice. I think these are like 
24 karat white gold. So they're really nice, but now I'm missing a bag. So great. What a day. And I repeat it three times. I hate being here so late, but it's so nice being the only person here. Like it's 10.30, I should probably be in bed, but oh well. Well guys, thanks for watching another fantastic video. I'm gonna go home, hop in the shower again, really quick body shower, uh, grab a protein drink, and then go to bed because I work at Walmart tomorrow, 8 a.m. to 5. Really, I should film tomorrow because there's a good chance I'll be in apparel tomorrow working on swimsuits and beach bags. But do I need another video to sit and wait to be edited and uploaded? No. No, I don't. We'll see what happens. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one.